Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be sharing with you some shoes I recently hauled. I haven't bought shoes in a little while, so I can kind of justify it that way. Um, they aren't super expensive either, so I can kind of justify it again that way. But I had to buy some shoes to refresh my wardrobe, especially for fall. So these are perfect for fall, but I kind of feel like you can wear these all year round. And I also have a Gucci dupe for you guys. So if you've been wanting the Gucci Princeton shoes, I think that's what it's called. I have a perfect dupe for you guys. It's so affordable, you won't even believe it. So if you do want to see my Gucci dupe and what I hold, then just keep on watching. So I am going to be showing you a pair of shoes that I already wore. And if you guys are on my Instagram, you would have seen this in one picture. I didn't focus on the shoes in the picture, but they are in one picture. So if you guys are not following me on Instagram, I'll link that down below for you guys as well. So, you know. Hey, let's be friends and this is the first pair of shoes and I absolutely love them I have to say I don't know if you guys can see them. There you go. You can see them a lot better They are super casual shoes. They are sneakers But I would say they are slip-on sneakers obviously because you don't have to tie them up this is in a size seven. I did try on the six and a half in the store and the size seven. So I did get the size seven. Now the size seven is a little big on me. I would say it's just like a tad bit big on me, but that's okay in my opinion. Like that's okay for me because when I walk, it's not slipping. So it is just a little big because when you put your foot in there, you can see on the side there is a little room, which is fine for me. I don't care about that. My Chanel shoes are like that as well. I don't really mind it. And even after a long period of time of wearing them, it doesn't bother me. It doesn't like slip or anything like that. So if they stay like this and just give a little bit more, that'll be fine. They still won't slip on me. So if you are wondering how they fit, I would say they fit a little small, like a tad bit small. So my perfect size would probably be in the middle of a six and a half and seven, but of course there is nothing in the middle. So I did go with the seven. I sized up a half a size. I also do have wider feet. So if you have wider feet, definitely size up half a size if you have slim feet I would definitely go with your exact size just to try it out they are 100% genuine leather on top they are gray they are very light gray I would say so as you guys can see they do have holes in them so I feel like that's perfect for fall you can wear these with socks I feel like you can wear them with very thin socks if you need to or you could wear them without socks is how I've been wearing it and also you can probably wear these with those very thin stocking socks so these are just perfect at first when I wore these I thought they were gonna be rubbing the wrong way because one of my toes felt like it was rubbing a little bit and I was like okay I sized up half a size and they're still rubbing so I wasn't really sure how that was gonna work out but the more I wore it I guess the more it was loosening up a little bit and forming to my foot which was really good so that rubbing ended up going away and I didn't end up with any blisters or calluses or anything like that they are just really pretty. I absolutely love them. I feel like this is something that I can get away with even in winter, especially if I wear them with socks, like really low cut thin socks. I could definitely get away with wearing them. And I live somewhere where it is super cold, but you get snow. I mean, I wouldn't wear them in the snow, obviously, but I definitely think I can get away with them dead of winter when there's no snow out with socks, without socks, you know, as long as I'm in my car or going into a store or something like that, it would be all good. Um, these are great for running around to doing errands. If you have kids, these are perfect. So I'm going to be dressing these up and down just depending on like what I'm wearing. This is something that I could wear leggings with and it's also something I could wear jeans with, you know? So I definitely wanted something I can wear Basically every day if I wanted to, I could basically live in. And this is something I definitely feel like I can live in is why I purchased it. I just thought the gray was perfect. It was just a really nice gray. I just absolutely love how they look. And I love how they look on, of course. So over here, I don't know if you guys are gonna be able to tell, but they do have like a little elastic, so they will stretch a little bit to your foot as well, which I really like. So I don't have to use a shoehorn with this to get it on. See the six and a half, I would have had to have a shoehorn because it was that tight. And I just didn't want to do it because I wasn't really sure how much it was going to give, like I said. So I just wanted to make sure that I was comfy. So over here, I don't know if you guys can see, but it has a little gray. So it all goes together. It's just really 
pretty. I just love this shoe so much and I'm gonna get so much use out of it. So because I love those shoes so much, I did pick a second pair up in a different color and I got them in rose. So this color is actually really pretty. To me, it looks more like a blush, but they do call it rose. I just love how this looks as well. So you can wear this exactly how you would wear the gray ones, dress it up, dress it down. This one is also leather and I absolutely just love the color. I don't think I'm gonna be wearing this one though as much as the other one. I feel like this is something that I'm only gonna be wearing like if I wear black or if I wear pinks or blushes, creams and things like that. So I definitely am gonna get use out of this one but I definitely think the gray one will be like my go-to. This one will be with only certain colors, you know? But I still really love the color of it, and I just love the shoe in general. They have so many different colors. I wanna pick them all up, to be quite honest with you, because I love all of them, even the darker ones. I believe they have like black, they have dark blue, they have so many different ones, and I really love the shoe that much that I did pick up a second pair, and I kinda wanna pick up a third pair, but I think I should just stick with two for now. That's what they look like side by side. They look exactly the same same they're the same exact shoe except this one is the gray this one is the rose and this one has the gray outlining around it versus this one where it has no pink outlining it's just straight up white so I just absolutely love both of them they are just so gorgeous guys you see this like can I wear one pink and one gray? Would that be weird if I went out like that? They are just the perfect grab and go shoe. Like if you don't know what to wear or you don't even have to think about it, you're just like, okay, I know I want those slip on shoes right now. Those are the perfect shoes to wear with my outfit. You know what I mean? They're like a no brainer. So I just absolutely love these and I definitely am gonna get a lot of use out of them. Next up, these shoes are super cute. I just absolutely love these. I actually never planned on purchasing these. I went to the store and I was just looking around and I ended up stumbling upon these and I was like, okay, let me try them on. And I knew once I tried them on, like they had to be mine. I just absolutely love the look of them. I love the feel of them. They are super comfy on. I haven't wore these, but when I was walking in the store, they were super comfy on and I just love them so much. So this is what they look like in the front. They are just really nice. They are leather also. I believe they are new book leather and that's what they look like on the side so you get a little heel to them which is nice but it's not something that's going to give you height it's just a little something to bring you up a little bit and that's what they look like in the back which is super cute again on the side and there is like no zipper or anything like that you just put your foot right in so the color is dark stone i absolutely love it i just couldn't resist this color it is a little darker than those other shoes that i just showed you so they are just really really pretty looking and i feel like again this is something that you could wear in fall even in winter if you wear socks with it or even without like i said i'm probably not gonna wear socks with this but i might i just don't know depending on like the weather and when i wear and what I'm doing and all that um, on the side it does have again like one of those elastics so I guess when you put your foot in there it's going to stretch a little bit just to be able to get your foot in there and get your foot out but I don't think it's something over time is going to give at all I think it's gonna be just perfect and it's gonna stay the same because the way it's cut um, this I did get in a size 7. They only had a size 7. If they had a size 6.5, I probably would have gotten the 6.5 because these are a tad bit too big on me. Like just a teeny bit, but they still are very doable. They do not slip when I walk in them. So even though that I did get a size 7, they do not slip. So they are still really good and wearable for me. I also want to mention like in the back, See, in the front, let me just show you. So in the front, you can see right through the holes. Like you could just see right through it. So when your foot is in there, you'll be able to see it a little bit versus the back where you can't see anything. There is no holes, even though it's the same design. There is nothing in the back that's showing your foot. So it's like complete shoe in the back versus 
the front where it is a shoe but you can still see a foot does that make any sense i hope so but i do really like that as well so even if you are not wearing any socks with these these will still be really good really comfortable still a little warm because it's not open all the way around and i feel like you can definitely dress these up and dress them down i love these with light distressed jeans they just look so good even if they're a little darker jeans they look really good and they are the perfect color for all year long I just absolutely love these I can't wait to wear these so that's what the bottom looks like so there is a little tread to them which I really like and I appreciate so I believe the bottom is rubber I think like this whole sole is rubber and also this one little bit on the bottom is rubber the whole heel isn't rubber so it's just that one teeny layer and they are more of a pointy round toe so they're not completely pointy and they're not completely round they're just like the perfect toe I just absolutely love that I just feel like they are the perfect booty for fall and again you could wear these all year long like I feel like I could wear this in summertime because you do have the breathability of the leather as well okay so next up is my Gucci dupe and I'm super excited to be sharing this with you guys because I did have a Valentino dupe before and I'll link that video down below for you guys if you wanted to check it out so I absolutely love finding dupes for you guys and especially for myself because I know personally I don't have the money to constantly go go buy designer products, especially the ones that I have been eyeing myself for a really long time. If I do purchase something like that, I do save up and then I purchase it. So I know a lot of people out there don't have the extra funds or they just don't want to spend the money on it. And I don't blame you guys because they are shoes, they are expensive. So even though I absolutely love the Gucci shoes, like I want to buy a real pair, but you know, I wanted to see if I liked it first to be completely honest with you guys. So I wasn't really sure if I actually wanted to buy it or if I even would like it so I wanted to see if I wanted to even like this type of shoe because I never really had this type of shoe before in my collection I found this and I couldn't believe how much of a dupe it was I had to share it with you guys you will have the opportunity to get that look without that high price tag you know of course with the real Gucci shoes you are getting the real leather you are getting the quality you're getting the name and all that good stuff that we are paying for but that's okay because some people don't care about that I personally am happy I have these shoes I love them and to be completely honest I don't even know if I would purchase the real one after having this one because you still get the look you still get the style and you still have the amazing feeling when you wear them because you love what you're wearing you know so this is the shoe I was talking about this is the exact look and style of the Gucci Princeton shoe. If I am saying that name wrong, I do apologize and I will list the real one down below for you guys. It looks exactly like the real deal. I absolutely love these. They are comfortable. I wore these when I went shopping. I wore this to work and I just thought they were super comfortable. I don't feel like there is any issues when you walk with them. I don't feel like my foot kept slipping out. It was just like the perfect fit. I did try the six and a half on and the seven and these are the seven. I felt like these are a little better for the seven versus the six and a half for me personally because I do have a wider foot and also I felt like my heel was coming out just a little bit like over here. So I went with the size seven and I'm really happy I did because I think if I did the six and a half, I wouldn't be satisfied with it at all. So definitely make sure they fit you. Definitely make sure your heel isn't out a little bit because you will probably not enjoy them like I probably wouldn't have if I got the wrong size so just want to let you guys know that so I did dress this up when I went to work so I had leggings on I just had a black top on it wasn't anything special it was just a basic black top and then I put this on and honestly it just looked so good it looked all put together and this added a little style and flair to the outfit seeing how it was a little plain for work you know and then you just add this because it has this little look in the front that obviously it's like the Gucci look so you do have a little more of a dress up shoe so your whole outfit just comes together a little bit more and it looks a little more stylish so I just absolutely loved it and then you know when I walk like I said it is super comfortable I didn't feel like my foot was coming out at all it was just really nice it was perfect fit for me um, this is what it looks like on the side so 
and I did wear them and it doesn't look like I even wore them too much but I have worn them so that's actually kind of funny that it's not like super super dirty on the bottom so I actually do appreciate that because I feel like it's a good sole it's probably gonna last a little while but yeah that's what it looks like on the side so as you guys can see it basically is an exact dupe of course it's not the exact leather they use calfskin leather this is obviously not calfskin for the price tag of it this is leather I'm just not sure what kind of leather so it doesn't say so I'm not sure if it's bonded leather I don't know if it's just straight up leather I will find that information out and again I will link everything down below for you guys but I just love how this looks it has such style to it and it does have like this little carving over here and it has a little tongue over here and that's just what it looks like on the side again it's just really beautiful it even is not like super pointy or super round it's exactly how the gucci shoe is i would say like if i had the real one which i obviously don't have so i can't like put it next to each other but i have seen it in person and i have seen it online and it looks basically identical so if i did have them side by side and if they weren't exactly the same they are so similar that you probably wouldn't even notice unless you looked at the logos to be quite honest these are so so pretty and that's what they look like in front so when you are wearing them and walking or just standing there that's what they look like they just add something so special to an outfit like i said when i dress this up with like my basic leggings and a basic top they just look so so good i couldn't believe it I just really love these so much. I actually might get a second pair to make sure in case of anything that happens with this one that I will have a backup to be quite honest with you because I have seen other shoes very similar but they always had maybe a little more of a point or they were a little too round. They just didn't look exactly right. You know, something was definitely off about them or they just didn't look exactly like the real deal versus this one where I think they look exactly like the real deal. It also has this little thing right here where this design is like put into. I'm not really sure if you guys can see that but it does have something right there. And then the inside looks like that. So it looks exactly like the real shoe as well. So I don't know, I just love these. I feel like these are just perfect for everyday wear. I feel like, you know, if you're going food shopping or if you're going to a school event or you're with your children or if you're in the office or you're working anywhere, to be quite honest, that you could wear shoes like this, this will be the perfect shoe, especially if you wanted to have that Gucci shoe this is the perfect look this is the perfect dupe I just absolutely love these so so much so I'm definitely gonna get a second pair before they run out because I did see these a while ago and they didn't have my size they were all sold out of a couple of sizes actually and I saw they brought them back so I had to grab one I should have grabbed two I really really should have grabbed two so that is my only regret that I didn't get two instead of one so that is my shoe hole and my Gucci dupe let me know in the comments what you guys think about the shoes also let me know what you guys think about the Gucci dupe. I also will be listing everything here down below like always and I will definitely find out the material made of these shoes. I have to let you guys know that. So everything will be down below. So yeah, it's pretty much it for today guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys did like this video and if you did, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Please come join our little YouTube family here. We'll love to have you and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys. Yeah.